Hi, my name is Kathleen and my project is the Wandering Tabletop Robot. So my second milestone was um, assembling the chassis and mounting the electronic circuit I built. And so you'll see now when I turn it on, it can drive around the table without falling off. So see it. So yeah, there we go. All right. Um, so once the laser cut pieces arrived, as you can see, it's mostly made out of acrylic. Assembling the chassis was just a lot of putting nuts and bolts together. Uh, the caster actually has two bearings, one that rolls along the ground and the other that is right here and allows it to spin side to side. You can see the one that rolls on the ground is covered in window screen spline, as are the wheels. This is for traction. Um, putting the ones on the wheels was a little bit more difficult since they're pretty thin. I had to cut along one of these ridges um, to get it on there. Once the chassis was assembled, I had to figure out how to mount my circuit, which was pretty difficult because there isn't a ton of space on my robot. But one cool thing I found is the shield for my Arduino that I got to implement my XBs later actually has a prototyping area on it. So I could use that to solder my circuit instead of a, mounting a separate PCB. So that was pretty space efficient. Um, and my sensors obviously had places to go at the front. So once I um, figured out where I wanted my Arduino, I actually had to take apart the chassis to drill holes and mount it and then put it back together. Um, then I just had to mount the infrared sensors I'm using to sense where the edge of the table is um, at the front. Uh, the, oh, the electrical they're actually glued to the chassis and the electrical tape is to cover the exposed wires. Um, so that is what I did for this milestone, and my next milestone will be um, implementing the XBs to make it remote control.